This is the Pocket Monster Manual. I am Willie Shambler, and uh, on the panel of esteem, esteemed Pokemon experts, uh, Race and Bran. You bet about it. Moogle. This ass be feeble. Shiny. I'm esteemed. <laughs> and Specross. I got nothing. Hi. We're talking about Feebas, the fish Pokemon. <laughs> is he really just the fish Pokemon? <laughs> this is, this is the fish. He is, he's just a fish. Finbas. <laughs> he's just a fish. I want to conceptualize something for everyone. So you see this picture of a prism scale forming on Feebas. Yes. No. Imagine this. Yes. A Feebas that is all prism scales. I'd tell you what he would look like. Let me find the image for you. I know, I think I know what you're going to pull up. You know him. Yeah, we know him. I know him well. That's him. Yes, I was right. <laughs> I knew it. Beautiful fish. <laughs> Thanks, Marcus. It's Feebas. Despite just being the fish Pokemon, this thing is pretty unique as far as Pokemon go because it's absolutely impossible to catch. The oh yeah, the method of catching this thing is fucking ridiculous. Does anyone remember what it is? Or should it's I? like one like it's like a set of tiles in a cave that you have to get there between like a certain time of day. Not just the cave, it's, it's the entire river between... Uh... Yeah, the cave you're thinking of is, uh, is in Gen 4, but in, in, in Hoenn, there's like the, the really long route with the river that runs through it. It goes up to Fortree City. Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah, yeah. And in that entire thing, there's two squares where you can catch Phoebus. Oh, I thought it was like five. Maybe which five. Is, it's not many, yeah. Which is interesting because it's, it's biology entries and stuff say that it can live literally anywhere. Like, it chooses to live only there. It chooses, you know? That's the nicest climate. Yeah. If you could choose, then why wouldn't you? Yeah, it's true. You would. That's the simple truth of it. Yeah, of course, this evolution is fucking amazing, which is why they make it so difficult. So there's six fishing spots for it in uh, Gen 3 and four nice. fishing spots in Gen 4. Yeah, I, I went for this thing back then as a kid. Never got it. Uh, I've never gotten it. Just, fuck you. Yeah. It's got bad memories written all over this thing. Do you, do you think it's like a, a programming error? Like it was supposed to be a bigger area? Or... No. Oh, no. No, no, it was no, definitely it's intentional. Because they did it two games in a row. Like, I don't feel like you can... I guess you could do that as an accident. But like, could you? No, I don't think you could accidentally do that. I don't see how you could possibly... Because there's no other like places in the game where like it's only one specific tile, right? They had to reprogram that. Yeah, if, it, if there was like dedicated fishing spots... Then maybe, but like that's not how it works in the old ones. Yeah, it's the only place in the game where there's dedicated fishing spots. It's Nintendo Power Bait, in the same way that many things are. Like they just they they just wanted you to have to buy something to find it. I fucking it. love that. I think that's great. I think we should have more of that. Quite frankly, I don't mind. No, I don't mind it. Like these days, it just spreads by osmosis anyway, like fairly instantly. So it's it's difficult to keep anything like this. Yeah, I wish it didn't. Yeah. I wish it was harder to find and verify information. You pretty much you just have to play a game during its first week of release and ignore the internet. Yeah, and that's the only way to do it. It's like a monkey's paw, though. It's like, uh, oh, I wish we could go back to the days when all the information wasn't readily available, but also then you'd be stuck with that kid on the playground telling you about Mew under the truck. But that's what I want. But he's there. We just need to try harder. But that's what I want. I want liars. I want people who tell lies for, for clout. Mish. Mish. Yeah. Imagine if we had more Mitches in the world. Elden Ring kind of bringing that back with the illusory wall that takes oh, 40 God. hits to yeah. break through. The one that takes like 9,999 damage. You just have to keep hitting it. Every Souls game has that. Like in, in Dark Souls, there were those two illusory walls in the swamp in the like middle of nowhere that took you to a whole area that you could miss otherwise. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I think, I think that's what I love about like when games do that thing where you have to like wait four real time hours for shit. <laughs> <to play that. laughs> that's it. Has uh, that feeling of it, you know? And that's what this guy is. He's that feeling. He's lovely. Also. Um, a lot of the, the Pokedex entries for this one are like, it's really ugly and shabby and nobody wants to train it. But then if they knew it evolved into Militic, like it must be that, that the people who have got Militics are like holding on to that information. They're like, oh, oh yeah. I don't want everybody to have a Militic. Oh. They're yeah. like, no, no, I won't breed it for you. But if you give me like three years and then come back, I'll give you one. Like, pay me. Yeah. Unattractive, unpopular, it is the shabbiest Pokemon of all. Nobody pays any attention to it. Is, is some out 
But then, but it's even then, like at least on the Bulbapedia entry, it says there are those who love to collect Feebas and only Feebas, and reportedly are disappointed when it evolves into Melotic. There's no source for that. What what do they get in this from? I know, like I'm I'm wondering where that comes from, if anywhere. Like I I imagine there must be at least one person. The same way there's a guy with six level fifty magic arps in in some of the games. Like it's black, I think. It, that's probably just like some like mylotic mylot propaganda. Yeah, probably. Oh, you don't need to evolve him. Oh, poor poor Phoebus. Like I, I bear no ill will towards Phoebus. Is it bad to train as well? Is it like really hard to get it to evolve? The Pokedex entries call it sturdy, but its stats are ob- absolutely awful. Yeah, they're pretty bad. Apparently, it can just live anywhere, and it's just it's 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 got good vitality. Allegedly, it can just it can just go places and do things. Both both of which are proven wrong by the game itself. Yeah. I I've just made the mistake of looking at the mystery dungeon, like uh his like his speech, like I feel genuinely bad. Uh fifty one to hundred percent. Do you know what it feels like to be ignored by everyone? No. Oh no. Twenty six to fifty. I'm worried my health has gone down to half. One to twenty five percent. I'm done for. I tried so hard, even though I look shabby. Level up. I've leveled up. Does it make me look less shabby? Oh No, it doesn't. You look like shit. Um, in the sword and board... Oh, no, this is a brilliant diamond. They kind of corrected the, the errors of previous where they said they can live anywhere. It says, although populous, they cluster in set locations. So it says, that, like, yeah, there's a lot of them, but they, they only live in specific places. Has anyone caught this legitimately? No. I never have. I mean, I have in the easier games where it is like in in the Hoenn remakes. There's like a set place where they always show up, yeah. like under the bridge. So I've, I've done that, but I've never like gone the genuine. hard way. I feel like I might. I, I feel like I I have one in Pokemon, not Bank. What's it called? It's the other thing. Coliseum. No, it's it's the Gen Three one. Pokemon Box. Oh, Pokemon Box. I had Pokemon. Box. Yeah, I feel like I may have one in Pokemon Box somewhere. That or I will have traded it upwards, like through through the years into. Like, because that was possible. I feel like I have, would have had one at one point, because I remember taking the effort. I've definitely had one in some games before. I had one, but I definitely didn't catch it myself. I think I knew somebody who had one, and then he, like, pranked me one. I never bothered. I remember trying for, like, two hours and then being like, nah. Poor guy. Or is he? That's Zelda, not Pokemon. Excellent stuff.